These kids knew you'd come to save them. How sad to be right in front of someone and not be noticed at all. You are chosen by the gods, and the only thing that keeps you from turning into a spirit is, uh, or into a dark monster when you enter the twilight. And no one knows what you have done. You may be doomed to toil in obscurity forever. You're the, you're the type to worry about everything, I can tell. But don't fret over Princess Zelda. She chose this state of affairs after all. Anyway, what's with having to light candles to get to the basement? Not very subtle, is it? I don't... What a rude companion. <laughs> they think she's uh, the best. But yeah, no. Like, so much shit that, that she just said there. Was I, insulting. <laughs> it was rude. Well, uh, more like every single thing that just happened. Like, I love that scene a lot. Um, for like a couple reasons, you know? Like, one, like... It's so, um, I don't know, it was so powerful to me that, like, those little kids, like... You, you remember when I was talking to you, and I was like, I was like, in a lot of the games, you're kind of the hero, because, like, you just basically get told that you are the hero, and you kind of like... And I mean, I'm not saying that this is any exception, because, like, you know, it's the whole chosen by the gods thing. Um, but, like, I really feel like... Link very personally earns that title amongst these people in this game. You know what I mean? Like, he really kind of earns that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I, I'm not saying he doesn't earn it in other ones. It's just, like, how can I word it? Um, you know, There's, um... You like to think that he's choosing to be a hero. Kind of, yeah. Yeah, I suppose that you could say that. Um, well, there's this other thing where, like, after we do some shit here, um, Renado, he's gonna be like, um... He's gonna be like, there are legends of a hero who, clad in green who saved our kingdom a long time ago, and everything that you're doing reminds me of him. You know what I mean? Yeah. So like, I don't know. It, it just feels much more. It feels different. I don't actually necessarily know what I'm trying to say right now, but I'm sure I'll understand it at a different time. But yeah, I don't know. That scene with the kids always hit me really hard because Colin has no reason to believe that Link's gonna save him besides like hope. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> it isn't the life I would have chosen, but here we fucking are! My name is Jeffrey. <laughs> I am one of the light spirits of Hyrule. I am the spirit that guards these lands. In my free time, I like to shred gnarly waves and go to the smoothie Yeah, store. I'm just like you. Oh, great hero. I enjoy frozen gods. yogurt in times by the beach. Look at my weird little chin mandibles. The dark power you seek lies in the sacred grounds of the proud mountain dwellers. But already those grounds have been defiled, draped in shadow, and seated with evil. Not seated. <laughs> Anything but seated. You must go to those sacred grounds and cleanse them. Cleanse them of the seed. I really like to make it like he just is having so much trouble talking. <laughs> <sighs> that was a good one. Alright, back to sleep for a thousand years. Farewell. Ah, oh, now my boots are soggy. You, uh, remember Gerald? No, who's that? Oh, this is gonna happen first, though. Link? What? I was just talking. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Colin's dead. <laughs> <laughs> I love Colin. Ha ha ha, see, Beth, I told you Link would say- You didn't say shit! I was aware that Link would come. I must now kill you. And take your place as the hero. I have some of the gods. I have some of the gods. I have some of the gods. <laughs> you are the one from Odon who these children speak of. We are well met. I am Renado, shaman of this town. And this is Jeremy. This is my daughter, Luda. Luda! Luda! We now is 13. <laughs> The beast took us and left us to die, but Mr. Renado found us. At first, I couldn't believe they had come from such a distant place as the Ordona province. Yeah, I was smoking that dank kush, so we don't really remember much. All of a sudden, everyone was captured, and then until now, it's been like... Mmm, peanut butter. Nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah! It was like a terrible dream and couldn't wake up. Mm, nightmares are everywhere these days, it seems. This village has certainly seen its share of recent hardships. The dark beasts attacked, but even worse was the sudden and inexplicable change in the mountain dwelling Goron tribe. They had long been our friends, but suddenly treated us like foes, even now they refuse to permit us entry into their minds. It strains the limits of belief to think that such a gentle and proud tribe could change so suddenly. I'm kind of switching accents with this guy. Yeah. <laughs> it sort of slowly started Spanish. Is it a guy? Yes. Okay. I originally thought it was not a guy, but it is a guy. Uh, I, of course, cannot leave my village in such a time. There's no telling what may happen to us here. But slowly, like all accents, that I, <laughs> it's just a weird angle. Uh, devolved into a like a Slavic type of role. Uh, what am I doing? Loot up! <laughs> <laughs> Trying to go to the mines is very dangerous. I'll be very sad and to be separated. Oh, God. This is basically I may break your heart, but you gotta respect my honesty. <laughs> <laughs> I do not know what is in the Guaron mines, or surely they will come to understand and write, uh, but it's whatever. Suck at the kids. I don't want to leave all these people just to save ourselves. Come on, Link, can't you do something? Isn't there some way to make up with the Gorons? You'd think someone could go into the mines and do something. <laughs> talk to me, Colin. Colin! I don't want to talk to any of you. I want to talk to Colin. Can I not just talk to him individually? All right. He seems to be going through some things right now. They all kind of are. Oh, yeah, I remember what I'm supposed to do. Well, you won. Get in <laughs> defeated. You never know where to look these days. Yeah. So uh, we're gonna try and do a thing with these motherfuckers. You ready? Yeah. Yeah. Who's motherfuckers? The Gorons. Are these ones alive? Yeah. I mean, everyone's been alive. It's just when they're in the twilight realm, their spirits. Okay, boom. So, we're gonna climb up here. This is, um, I don't know, this is kinda, this is kinda errandy in my opinion, but whatever. It's kinda cool to keep the world all connected with itself. It's kinda what? Yeah, you'll understand what I mean in a second. Hey. Ah, no humans allowed. These lands ahead belong to the Goron tribe. The elders said no humans may pass. <laughs> Immediate hostility. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. See that? I can't really catch that guy. Like, I could catch the rams. Uh, you can fuck me up, bitch. Listen, next time you come around here, I'm gonna fucking tell everybody. Yeah, so uh, I had to do that. In order to learn that I cannot catch them like I could catch the goats. Like, you, can't, you can't just whoop them into a into into a confined well, space. Well, remember when the goat was running away and I can kind of... Well, you didn't actually see that because I fucked up. Oopsies. Uh, how fortunate you are in one piece. I saw you heading up to the mountain trail and I was worried. Are you trying to reach the Gorons of Death Mountain? It's far too dangerous, Link. They recognize only strength. The normal poisoning can never persuade them. Mm, all of those things I found out like two minutes ago. But I do know one person who was able to best them and earn their trust. His name is Bo. You mm. may know him as the mayor of your hometown, Ordon. Please go to him. And while and you he's are there, the greatest like rapper ever. <laughs> <laughs> of course, getting them back would be best, but we could not keep them safe from the monsters on the ho on the road without a horse and cart. Please return to Ordon and inform their parents uh, that their children are free from harm. Give them my word. But yeah, so what I'm saying is basically, now we have to go back to Ordon to talk to the mayor. And one thing I've always kind of, like, you know, I... Does this really happen now? <laughs> No, I, I've just got a... Is that Gerald? Yeah, it's Gerald. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, you remember him? Yeah. I don't like this. I don't like anything that's about to happen. So basically, Gerald's freaking out. I don't understand. This whole thing is just kind of... Wacky? Yeah. So yeah, see, I've got to hold on to the right direction, and like, there's so little room for leeway that I have to like switch it like right away. Oop. Oh, that was easy. Uh, a lot easier than I remember it being. Uh, so I've calmed Gerald. Hmm. The way you just swiveled your hips on my back just calmed me. Yeah. 
Like uh, Link's hip swiveling uh, could calm any any man or woman or horse in distress. Any beast of nature. Not too shabby a wrangler after all. Won't this make getting back to your town a lot easier? Now go finish your errands so we can get back and move on. Yeah, okay. So what I was saying is... Um, so we gotta go back to Ordon now. And um, this kind of, like, not like a big gripe, but a gripe I've had with some Zelda games is that it kind of feels like in some of them it's like you go through one place and then you're done there forever and you're never supposed to go back. So I think it's kind of cool when, like... The, the world still feels... Ah, I fucking... Can you stop interrupting me for four seconds? Millions. Dead. I've seen them all. <laughs> yep. From Uku. Oh, yeah. You know. From Jakku Ja. It's the weird thing that you were really petrified to see. That thing looked like a fucking alien. Yeah, it kind of does. But yeah, so, uh... I like it when they kind of keep the world connected and it's like... It, like, the place still exists and is relevant even after you're done doing the thing that you were doing there. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I feel like, um, this was kind of a cool way of doing that. <laughs> it's... It, I don't know. It, it's like... A little more streamlined. What? Well, it's better than like, I don't know, it's like... Hmm. I've eaten dinner at Applebee's. I shall now never return to this Applebee's. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Or, or it's like... It's like, um... I don't know, like, how, how could I word it? Um, well, no, I mean, I don't know. You can just kind of word it best with what's actually happening. It's like, I solved the problem of Ordon, and now there's no need for me to ever go back there again, even though there might be mm. stuff you could benefit from by going back there. You know what I mean? Like, because that's how things really are. I've already shit in this bathroom. I must move on to other ones. Yes, exactly. Stop. Okay. Beep. Man, I've got to say, uh, I'm fucking rich. As Link. Yeah? Yeah. Come on. I love Still could only buy one fucking jar of oil. <sighs> jar of oil that cost a hundred rubies. Yeah. Like, that's, that's an expensive ass jar. He's making a killing. He really is. Um. And the whole thing, too, with how, um. I don't think I forgot about that. Oh, whatever, I'll just do it next time. I can I can cut these ropes. I always thought that was fun. Is it really not? Okay, whatever, I don't care. Yeah, um, they kind of keep that connection going, too, with, like, you teleport. You, you know that teleport thing that we did to the bridge? Yeah. You do that in other places in the game, too. It's just kind of cool. You know. Yep. Yeah. Remember this place? Uh, yeah. Goss. Link's humble beginnings. Goss. He must return. Yeah, the, uh, I don't know, the manga's cool. Because you remember how John bought me the manga? Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's a little bit different, but I like it. I'm just gonna leave, uh, leave Gerald here. And, uh, I wanna go talk to the kid's parents, because I don't think I've actually done that any time I've played this game. Even though, uh, Renado asked us to tell him all that they're safe. So I'm gonna do that and see if they say anything. Hey. Sup, girl? I've been waiting for you. <laughs> I heard you were safe and sound. By who? Who, who do you hear that from? <laughs> no one talks to me. I heard it through the wind. It relieves me to see that you are hale and hearty. That's interesting. <laughs> oh, oh my god. <laughs> what? Am I- what? <laughs> you remember when she was like, uh, will you just come back to my house quick? No! <laughs> no! What? No, they're not fucking. Oh. Me. Colin's alive. Oh. She, she thought her kid. Yeah, Colin's alive. <laughs> he's fucking so alive. Oh, he's breathing. I don't think Link's the kind of guy who'd fuck a pregnant That woman. was like, what? Do they mean to make it look like that? No, I don't know. Is that like a joke? Is it like know. a meta joke? Maybe. Oh, the children are all safe. Oh, how wonderful. I'm so glad I kept the faith. That my thanks to you, Link, from the bottom of my heart. Have you told everyone else yet? You must tell them all. I'm working on it. This is a really good soundtrack, too, the one that's happening in here. You hear it? Yeah. Oh, Link. That sword. What the <laughs> fuck is going on? Leave. You gotta get out of here. The evil creatures stole it from Russell, but you... Well, actually, um... Wait. No. Oh, well, I am actually the evil creature. You are the evil creature that stole it, and you still have it. How wonderful. I know it was safe in your hands, and you need it now, yes? Please keep using it. Oh, well, Link, I hope you'll return again to show your signing, shining face. It does my heart to see, good to see that you're well. Oh, my God. Yeah, they're having an affair. <laughs> like, for real. How, hey. old, how old is Link in this one? Uh, I think he's 18. The oldest, 19. Yeah. Like, I, the, Twilight Princess Link, I'm pretty sure, is canonically the oldest Link you've played as. 
Um, 